they're booing because they hate you. It became the most surprising event in the world of reality television. Fans of reality TV have seen the clip or talked about the moment. Now, it's time for the full story on stage and behind the scenes. It's the story you'll have to see for yourself. From Boulevard 3, the hottest club in Hollywood, it's Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, honoring the best in reality television. Fox reality shows just rock hard. From the dark side of reality TV. Really terrible. The money in the bank is killing me. To the softer side. It's kind of overwhelming because it's all happening so fast, but I'm I'm just taking it all in and enjoying it. Get ready to hobnob with the newest and brightest reality stars. Cassandra. From the red carpet to backstage. What's going I'm on then? I'm just trying to find who's here who will smoke weed with me later. It's where old friends get reacquainted. I love reality. It's fun. And I love it, especially when I'm in charge and I can tell everybody what to do. And new ones are made. I know you. I've been, uh, I finger banged you. Oh, that's right. It's definitely fly by the seat of your pants. Don't know what's going to happen. All raw. It's reality. It's time to pay homage to your favorite winner, favorite fight, favorite hottie. They're now very famous, uh, and, and I'm very proud of them. And discover who is the reality performer of the year. Join your host for the evening, Kennedy, plus performances and special appearances from over 100 of your favorite reality stars, including Ryan Seacrest, Hugh Hefner, The Girls Next Door, Evil Dick, Sanjaya, Brooke Hogan, Christopher Knight and Adrian Curry, Simon Cowell, Dr. Will, Mike Boogie, The Charm School Girls, Randy Jackson, Scott Bayo, The Ollie Girls, Rock, Danielle and Jen, Paul Abdul, Ant, Ron Jeremy, Danny Bonaducci, plus a surprise appearance by the LA County Fire Department's paramedics. Right now, on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. It's Chris Crocker, bitches. You all know me from the Leave Britney Alone video, but tonight's not about Britney. It's about real white trash. Reality TV stars. And they're all not just white. These next performers are proving that trash comes in all shapes, sizes, and colors. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the girls from Charm School. Who'd you expect? Pretty bitches? <laughs> the Quiet! Fox Reality Channel, Really Awards 2007! Hey, bitches! Come on, man! Shut up! Really, really fun, really, really fun, really, really hot, really, really mean, really, really you. Really Awards, we're doing it. Reality style! Get the hell up! Everybody's going, it's reality's biggest night. This is not the least performance of the year in paper fight. Teacher competition shows we got the girls next door to the charm school girls. Our favorite hottie, our favorite winner, our favorite tears, and our also favorite villain. Now, Evil Dick from Big Brother 8, and Chance Pot Crystal Pot right in the face. Get ready to rock! Big Horn Screech, Jenny Baby Passing Heat. He ain't a rock star, that's a goldy beat. Simon likes to talk trash every week. We got to feel it, Jenny Lee. Drop beauty in the geek. 15 seasons. Survivor's still hard, Dre's 45 and Cecil, and still in charge. Got Giant Rock and Pony Hunt, Mary got a laugh. Reality TV, they said it wouldn't last. Really, 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 really,
Well done. Well, hello, everybody. On behalf of Fox Reality Channel, I want to welcome you all to this evening's show. While Reality Remix covers the daily highlights of Reality TV, tonight we cover an entire year. It is our second annual Reality TV award show. Welcome to the Reallys. Oh, I love it. Reality TV continues to get bigger and bigger. Well, except for all the fatties on Celebrity Fit Club. They really scale down. And of course, we owe it all to you, the glorious, gorgeous, voluptuous reality stars gathered here tonight, and you, America, with your boundless curiosity to see what these knuckleheads are gonna do next. Because, bitch, I don't know, tonight anything can happen. Whether it's Captain Sig fishing for crab on Deadliest Catch, or New York fishing for a new boyfriend on Deadliest Snatch. Reality TV has entertained a nation and will always continue to do so. So to honor the luminaries in reality, we present these Fox Reality Channel Really Awards. And by the way, as long as we have your ear, Reality TV, we are also offering a few suggestions. For instance, it's just possible you may have noticed the girls in the hot tub. Well, it turns out they're real life hookers. They star in HBO's Cat House. Well, let's present our first award of the evening. We brought together two extremes, polar opposites, yin and yang, matter and antimatter. From the girls next door, she's one quarter of the most famous couple in reality history, and he is the winner of Big Brother 8. Well, he could forget about a showmance. He could make a friend of that joint. Presenting the award for favorite showmance, please welcome Bridget Marquardt and Evil Dick. I have to say, I'm a little jealous of you, Bridget. Why couldn't we have a show, Mance? <laughs> well, let's start with the name Evil Dick. It sounds less like a name and more like a medical condition. Plus, a show, Mance is not as much fun as it looks. There's a lot of people and a lot of scheduling involved. No, you misunderstood me. I'm not jealous of you. I'm jealous of Hugh. Keep it up, Hev. The nominees for Favorite Showmance are... Favorite Showmance. Eric and Jessica. Eric played dumb to score. Boy, um... These are boobs. <laughs> what are boobs? These are boobs. Oh. Nate and Jenny Lee. Geek love made Jenny lose control. When I first came in the house, you know, I was like, I'm definitely not going to fall for a geek. But apparently I did. Jackie and Rebecca. They may have cut down on carbs, but not each other. DM and CT. You don't have to be in the third grade to flirt like third graders. No. DM's always concerned about the game. Always wants to find a way to sort of prepare herself for the duel. Dr. Will and Boogie. Dr. Will has a scalpel in his hand and a wink in his eye. Why don't you drop this down, let me take a peek there, and I'll tell you what I think. Okay. Just take this off. There's no other way around it. Danielle and Nick. Nick's a hunk. A hunk of cheese. No. No. Come on. Favorite showmats. And the Realitini goes to... It's a tie. Dr. Will Kirby and Mike Boogie. <laughs> Thank you very much. I think we won this last year, too. Is that right, Mike? Uh, yeah, we did. We did, actually. All jokes aside, the, f the fame is very fleeting. You're only going to get free clothes for Hugo Boss for so long. And I really appreciate Mike Boogie. He's been an amazing friend. And uh, I wouldn't be here without him. We've been doing this six years, and it's been a lot of fun. And? Eric and Jessica from Big Brother A. Lowering the mic for me. I see how it is. This should serve as notice 
to any five foot seven Jewish kid from New York. If I can be with this girl, there's hope for all of us. Thank you, guys. Best Showman's just got announced. Will and Boogie and Jess and Erica. I can see the Jess and Erica thing, okay? I can see that. I'm a fan. I realize that. The Will and Boogie thing is a complete fiasco. What do you guys think of this, this outcome? I think it's funny. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> um, personally, I didn't want to be remembered for Best Showman's because it's romance. And... Um, you can take that one to the bank. Yeah. Write that on the deposit slip, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Well, like last year, this is another great crowd, and you are a good-looking audience. I want to thank all of our nominees for coming, even the Cat House girls for coming over and over and over again. Well, and I see our youngest nominee, Ashley Farrell. Please stand up, Ashley. What a cutie pie. Why don't you come up on stage, Ashley? We would love to see you. Ashley is the girl from American Idol who was so excited to see Sanjaya. She actually started crying. Come on up here, sweetie. Oh, Ashley, are you crying? What a surprise. Oh, you're such a sweetheart. Is this a big moment for you? It's about to get bigger. Presenting the reality -tini for favorite fight, our supermodel Janice Dickinson and super achiever Sanjaya Malakar. Sanjaya, what hair? <laughs> well, it's, it's a huge honor to be here with the beautiful Miss Janice Dickinson. You know, uh, you know what? I was a little disappointed that I wasn't nominated, but you know what? It really doesn't matter. Who's going to fight? You want us to fight? Bring it, Sanjaya! And the nominees are... Favorite fight. Chance versus Mr. Boston. Mr. Boston didn't stand a chance. It felt like an asteroid came crashing down on Earth. Rocky versus Dreams. Rocky seems to think he's Rocky Balboa. <laughs> Dreams Keep it up, just Dreams. Said... Keep it up, guy. Seriously. Well, why don't me and you go up here right now? We could. Well, let's do that, that. Keep running your mouth. Bring it. Bring it, bro. Piers and Sharon. Sharon took a courageous stand. I found what you said to her offensive. Piers oh, just said, no, don't do this to her. Smiley versus Pumpkin. This pumpkin had passion and persuasion. Are you okay with being <laughs> by rich guys that just want to bang the <laughs> out of you and <laughs> on your fake <laughs> I'm not your <laughs> friend, thank you. Evil Dick versus Jen. Evil Dick talked to the hand and not very nicely. Get out of here. I don't care. Get your hand on my face. Get out of here, you crybaby little bitch. Safari versus H Town. Safari and H Town are sluggers, not huggers. <laughs> Favorite fight. And the winner is. Oh no, go, Sanjay, read, please. The beautiful girls from Charm School. <laughs> That's hot. Let's make love. Yeah, I just want to say, yes, we're definitely friends. And I will definitely still be there for you when you get out of rehab. And I'll be there when you get out of stripper school. I love you, VH1. Stay with us for more of Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Who will win the Realitini for favorite tears and favorite winner? If you look behind me, the Cat House girls are about to get totally nude. The hot tub heats up. I may not have won an award, but Plus, a special performance by So You Think You Can Dance winner, Benji Swimmer. Guys, let's, let's have you up on stage. Come on. And later, 
It's the unbelievable event the reality world will be talking about for years to come. All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. I got Eve. Socket, devil, rabbit. Let's do this. I'm almost there. All right, you ready? Let's go. Wow. How you doing? I'm Adam. Hi, Adam. I'm Eve. It's too weird. They've got a little captain in them. Got a little captain in you. Drink responsibly. Grab your cell and take the love test now. Simply text your name, kiss, his name to 282082 and get your latest result. Find out if you're a match made in heaven or a total mismatch. Text your name, kiss, his name to 282082. An important free offer for men with balding or thinning hair. My hair looks better than what it did when I was a teenager. I really think he looks amazing. I mean, and just I look at him. Men, no diet, no exercise program, no new set of clothes can ever improve your confidence, your good looks, and the way women look at you, the way a thick, full head of your own real hair will. And now you can have it in just four weeks when you call Hair Club right now. With over half a million success stories, Hair Club really will give you back your own head of real hair in just four weeks, easily, painlessly, and affordably. I just can't believe how much better he looks. He looks so handsome now. Life is about having fun. It's about looking good. I mean, 80% of feeling good is looking good. Call Hair Club now and get your own head of full, thick hair in just four weeks. Look younger. Feel more confident. Put that old swagger back in your step and put some zip back in your love life. Call Hair Club now. I wish I'd done it years ago. I, I wish I had known this was uh, an option. The reason the majority of men go bald is because of a sensitivity to the effects of dihydrotestosterone. It speeds up the life cycle of the hair follicles so that instead of hairs growing for six or eight years, the follicles essentially get burned out. Call now for your confidential appointment. We'll give you a free hair and scalp analysis. We'll explain what kind of hair loss you're experiencing and show you the tested and proven solutions we'll use. Remember, there are many different kinds of hair loss and Hair Club is the only one who can offer you a customized solution based on your unique type of hair loss and expectations. Get the head of hair you want and women love in just four weeks. Change your life forever. Call Hair Club now. I only wish I hadn't taken so long. That's what I'm telling you. Do it now. Call now for our free DVD and brochure shipped to you in a discreet plain envelope. Hair Club has the solution you want. Call now. Call 1-800-462-5001. That's 1-800-462-5001. Jenkins wearing last year's news. Jenkins needs to take a fashion boat over to Fashion <laughs> Island. <laughs> oh, with those shoes. Oh, nice. You're in. Am I into watching reality? Does chartreuse clash with men? I mean, how else would we know who's been voted off, who's still dancing, and who's in and out? That's right. Ooh, I love that monochromatic look. Function and plan, sporty. Brown is the new black, you know. <laughs> You're in. I can't live without my reality. And if you don't like it, then that's your problem, Bubba. Ooh! Here comes Madam President looking like something the cat dragged in. It's looking like tacky Onassis. Like some sort of rumpled stilt skin. Ooh, you are out of this world today. Shooting star. Yeah. If reality TV has taken over your life, we understand. We love it too. Fox Reality Obsessed. Welcome back to Boulevard 3, Hollywood's hottest nightclub, and the 2007 Really Awards. Welcome back to the Really Awards. We are honoring the hard-living and hard-loving world of reality TV. And here to present the award for best tears are two men who made half of the women in Hollywood weep when they announced that Scott Baio was getting married. From Scott Baio is 45 and single, it's Scott Baio and Wonder Years star and reality TV's top producer. It's Jason Kirby. I, I just have a quick question before we start. What's that? Go. Should, should the cuffs be buttoned or unbuttoned? Yeah, buttoned or unbuttoned? Unbutt unbutt unbuttoned. Unbutt, okay. That's right. a big question. Well, this is seriously, I'm what? so psyched to be here. Do you know why? Why? I'm, like, I'm, I'm, I'm ecstatic to be here. I'm beside myself because we are presenting the award for favorite tears. 
I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> well, you know, Scott, honestly, I'm, I'm not ashamed to admit it, but um, I, I mean, I cry. You know, like the time uh, on our season finale when Renee told you that she was pregnant. I mean, I cried. Really? Yeah, I did. I didn't know that. Well, you really care about me. No. <laughs> the nominees for Favorite Tears are... Favorite Tears, Jen. Jen's narcissism made us want to cry. This is a picture of everyone's seeing right now. <laughs> that sucks. 48-year-old Aaron blubbered like a baby. <laughs> I can't believe I'm crying. I'm cracking up right now. <laughs> Paula Abdul was unleashed. Way I've been treated like a piece of dog. When Amber cried, others smiled. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ashley Farrell. Ashley cries from the moment she wakes up. Favorite tears. And the uh, Realitini, thank you, I couldn't pronounce Tough that word. earlier, goes to her favorite tears, Amber, Big Brother 8. <laughs> I'm definitely a crier. I'm known as Wamber. We all know that. And I'm just an emotional person, and I count every single tear. I'm up to, like, 25,000 tears now. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for supporting me and all my crying. I appreciate it. <laughs> Eric and Jessica, you have to feel pretty good. You just won a huge martini glass for favorite showmans. Did you guys think you'd take the award home tonight? We were a real romance, so I didn't think we'd win showmance, but I love it. One of the best things about Fox Reality Channel's really award show season two is the unpredictability. In fact, if you look behind me, the Cat House girls are about to get totally nude, and things are about to heat up. Take a look. And now, please welcome to the stage, the season two winner of So You Think You Can Dance, Benji Schwimmer and the Synchronized Schwimmers. It's Kennedy, bitch. So you just lost best fight, right? Yeah, yeah. You got you and you and Chance were my shoe in to win. I totally agree. I mean, me and Chance like had a real fight, not like a little bitch fight where they're just like, "Oh, I hate you." We had a real in-your-face fight in the boxing ring where one of us got the <laughs> kicked out of us flying over the ropes and a, a broken nose. How could that not win? The next award is for favorite winner. It is presented by your favorite tequila, Cuervo Black. Our next presenters, well, 
Audiences know them by many names, most of which would be bleeped if I said them on TV. So please put your greasy little hands together for last year's best showmance. It's winners Mike Boogie Mallon and Dr. Will Kirby. Woo! So anyways, uh, I just want to say my favorite all-time winner would have to be that handsome champ of Big Brother All-Stars who, uh, well, happens to be me. For me, I'd have to go with the winner of Big Brother Season 2, which coincidentally is me. But anyways, we're here to present the biggest winner in reality TV this year. The nominees for favorite winner are... Favorite winner... Tyler and James. Through cooperation and teamwork, they triumph. Tyler and James, you are the official winners of the amazing race. Congratulations. Rock. Decent, humble, down to earth, and a five star chef. Evil Dick. This guy ended up a winner in his family life, too. Congratulations, Dick. You are the winner. Tracy Bingham. Tracy was surprised, and her reaction was adorable. Oh, no! You have won it all. You have won it all. Yule was one of Survivor's strongest players ever. The winner of Survivor Cook Island. <laughs> favorite winner. And the favorite winner goes to... Rock from Hell's Kitchen. Wow, this is something else. I am, uh, I'm like a fan here. I just want to say thank you. I met Warren G earlier. This has uh, inspired other people to do great things. I'm a cook on a reality show, so if that inspires people to do other things, I, you know, I'll keep cooking on reality shows if they have me. Thank you very much. We'll be back with more from Hollywood Hotspot Boulevard 3 and the 2007 Really Awards. Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, discover who wins the Realitini for favorite non-competition show and favorite altered state. No, 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 I was myself. I was myself. I did it. I'm not Chirral. Get the 411 with Amanda Avila in the Winner's Lounge. Air Force Amy walked in. And she had a man with her, and she said, Honey, I got to pay for these shoes somehow. Do you mind if we come in here with you? Plus, the unexpected event that continues to shake the reality world. All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. All right. I got Eve, socket, devil, rabbit. I'll be right out. Let's do this. I got dibs on socket. I'm almost there. All right, you ready? Let's go. Wow. How you doing? I'm Adam. Hi, Adam. I'm Eve. This is too weird. Yeah. What are the odds? Totally random. They've got a little captain in them. Got a little captain in you. Drink responsibly. Welcome to the babe space. Browse thousands of the sexiest babe pics on your cell. Text BASE to 28282. Get the hottest babe pics on your cell now. Text BASE and send it to 28282. Till now, one single letter has always been on America's favorite chocolate candies. So if you wanted to spell out your feelings with them, the one thing you could say was, hmm. But now, go to this website and you can create M&Ms that express so much more. So, not only can you say, I love Trevor, you can say, Trevor forever. Even wish someone a happy 40th birthday. But why stop? While you're online, you can let your folks know you remembered their anniversary. Announce a new arrival in the family. Even just say, thanks for being you. But remember, while there are millions of things you can say on America's favorite chocolate candies, the response is always the same.
And hey, order today and you'll even get a free bonus bag only online at mymms.com slash offer2. So get your free bag today at mymms.com slash offer2. My M&Ms, what would yours say? This Saturday, don't miss the search for the next Elvira, Elvirathon. First, it's an encore presentation of the series premiere. Then get two all-new back-to-back episodes. It's an Elvirathon, Saturday, starting at 11 p.m. on Fox Reality Channel. Will you accept this rose? Sure. Will you accept this rose? This is awkward. I'm just not into you. You could say I'm into reality. At least I know who's still racing, cooking, dancing, dating. You name it. If I want to watch, I'm going to watch. OK? If reality TV has taken over your life, we understand. We love it, too. She's got some issues. She buys a lot of roses. Fox Reality. Obsessed. He drives a diesel out of Dallas. Hauling cars out to the coast. It ain't the dream that he remembered. And just a few short years ago. But tonight at a truck stop. I'll drink in a cup The waitress grins and winks at him And says my shift's almost up With so much riding on the choice at hand The spirit of a boy All the wisdom of a man With so much riding on the choice at hand the spirit of a boy. Right choices. Or Pass them on. A message from the Foundation for a Better Life. Welcome back to Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. And now here's your host, Kennedy. Welcome back to the Fox Reality Channel 2007 Really Awards. And believe it or not, we just finished cleaning up from last year's bash. In fact, I think I still have some vomit in my hair from the top models. They just finished dinner in the bathroom and collateral damage. Well, presenting the reality TV for favorite non-competition series, it's the hosts of American Idol Extra. Please welcome to the stage J.D. Roberto and an American Idol season four finalist, Michaela Gordon. <laughs> trouble making eye contact with you right now. I'll just look straight ahead. You know, I have to say, all the breasts tonight look really perky, and I'm really, there are, congratulations. Some, there are some nice breasts out there, especially on you, Bonaduce. I was on a competition show. I've seen it. But, have you seen it? Yeah. Part of it. Mm -hmm. But I've got to say that the non-competition shows really have a lot to offer. I, I totally agree, Michaela. The problem with the world today is that everybody is so competitive it's nice to have a, a category where they're not competing, you know, they're not stabbing each other in the back. And the nominees for best non-competition series are... Favorite non-competition program, The Real World. The Real World has real post-teen angst. My Fair Brady. My Fair Brady is simply smashing. <laughs> 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 the deadliest catch went fishing for crab, but caught our imagination. The coils were right at my feet, so I had to jump out of the way real quick. Luckily, I didn't get in the bite. That's one of a hundred ways you can get killed on these boats out here. The Hills. Ugly personalities with pretty faces. It's good. You should do that when you meet people. Chris Angel Mind Freak. This show is pure magic. But he disappeared. Nowhere. Yeah! Yeah! Get it, baby! 
Scott Baio clung on to the happy days. I was running and gunning for years, dating every woman under the sun, like her, 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 these two, and well, you get the idea. Favorite non-competition program. And we have the envelope. Michaela, you ready? Ready. And the winner is... Scott Baio is 45. Scott Baio! Thank you. Uh, Don't forget the little people. I just want to thank everybody for watching. I want to thank VH1, and I want to thank this guy for coming up with the idea, and this woman for going through with it. <laughs> thank you guys very much. So, Laylene, you just won a big martini glass for our best fight. Now, when you got in that fight with Pumpkin, did you think that one day you'd win an award for it? Uh, no, I didn't, because at the moment, like, heat of the moment, I was really upset. But now I'm completely honored. Her and I have mended our friendship and everything. So we have a love-hate rela relationship. But you know what? When you're, like, good friends with a girl, you can say, hey, you know what? Sometimes I really hate you. Sometimes I really love you. But honestly, overall, she's, like, a lot of fun to hang out with and everything, and we totally get along. All right. Let's talk to the crowd a little bit. We've got our CBS contingent over here. Johnny Fairplay talking to Dr. Will, seeing if there's any way he can surgically implant some balls, finally get him to drop. Jedi Howie is here. Did I see Danny Bonaducci earlier? Where's Danny? Well, I see the guys from Sunset Tan. And the girls. Devin, Jeff, are the Ollie girls here? All blondes look alike to me. You guys are super sexy, though. All right, to present the reality -y for favorite altered state, we have an intoxicating beauty who certainly lives up to her name from Charm School. It's Hottie, and a man who proves you don't have to be under the influence of anything to have people say, what's he on? The winner of The Amazing Race 9, it's BJ Avril. Now, some consider altered states a sin and a crime, but I don't think any of them are here tonight. That's right. Altered states have been around since Genesis. The Sega Genesis. Remember that game with the werewolf and the, <laughs> and the things and the... Wait, that was Altered Beast. Oh. Right. Well, altered states have been around for a long time, and they'll be here long after Lost Call mm -hmm. has ended. You're right. You're totally right. You know, getting bombed may not be the original sin, but it's probably the reason that the original sinners hooked up in the first place. The nominees for Favorite Altered State are... Favorite Altered State. Heat. Mr. Drunky has a lesson for kids everywhere. You are in trouble. Ripsy would make a great guest on Jerry Springer. Frank was grading on a curve. Frank. Oh my God. People have done much worse things in Las Vegas. There are bodies in the desert that aren't for me. Pumpkin brazenly showed her pumpkins. So, do you like the Ah, oh, girl. Let's go. Like the f or do you like to make love? I just like my favorite altered state. And the winner is Frank, real world Las Vegas. Wow. Where's the camera? Mom and Dad, we did it! Thank you guys, I uh, killed a lot of brain cells along the way. It was a hard road here, but um, wow, I'm really proud of myself. Thanks guys. Stay with us for more of Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. <laughs> 
Coming up next on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, we award the Realitini for favorite villain and favorite hottie. It's gonna be a SmackDown. SmackDown, okay. Because I gotta Music stand up for my girls that I do like. I'm a major fan here. Mark Long interviews the non-winners in the Losers Lounge. Be honest. With you. I think I still think she's a hoe sometimes. Really? Plus. The surprise that stunned and astounded every reality fan in the country. I gotta ask you some questions so I know where you're at. Dude, I'm fine. I just want my tooth right in my mouth. Go away. Hey, don't talk to me that way, all right? Let me, let me just ask my questions and make sure you Are you kidding me? Look at this. All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Are you tired of constantly fighting that growing midsection? Well, now there's an easy way to lose pounds and inches. Introducing RED, the first rotation and resistance exerciser. RED's the easiest and most comfortable way to shape and sculpt an amazing core and midsection. RED's first breakthrough is its rotation movement, which gives you a full circular range of motion to isolate all the core muscles, the stomach, the abs, the love handle obliques, and the lower back. Then Red's second breakthrough is adjustable resistance buried deep inside that lets you control your workout for easier, faster results. Got my waist down six inches. I lost seven and a half inches off my waist. I lost nine inches off my waist. An independent review at the University of Houston says Red incorporates all the muscles in the core region. Red tones rock hard abs in a tighter, slimmer waistline without the backbreaking bending of conventional crunches. That's because you're off the floor and seated in a comfortable position on our deeply padded cushion so now you can exercise while you watch your favorite TV show or seated at your desk while you work when you use the red system you'll lose up to four inches off your midsection in two weeks so what would you rather do this or this this or this this or this it's just that easy I've lost weight everywhere the inches just fall off so don't work hard work easier with red call now and try red for the incredibly low price of $14.95 lose up to four inches off your midsection in two weeks get the body you deserve and try red for 30 days for only $14.95 and as an added bonus be sure to ask your operator how you can get red delivered to your doorstep free it's easier than you can ever imagine and red is not available in stores so the only way for you to get your red is to call right now call 1-800-506-7217 all right i got eve socket devil rabbit I'll be right out. let's do this i got dibs on socket i'm almost oh, there all right you ready let's go wow how you doing i'm adam hi adam i'm eve this is too weird <laughs> Totally random. They've got a little captain in them. Got a little captain in you. Drink responsibly. Own a timeshare? Turn it into cash with timeshares only. Why pay another maintenance fee, mortgage payment, or tax bill when you can turn your timeshare into cash? Call now and you'll receive your free information kit, including 10 secrets on how to buy, sell, or rent your timeshare for cash. Call now. Call now for your free information kit to buy, sell, or rent and turn your timeshare into cash. Call now, 1-800-699-5191. That's 1-800-699-5191. Call now. Saturday, Fox Reality Channel has a question. Who's the bee or host that will make love to a ghost? Elvira, darling. Spooky. She's picked 13 lucky ghouls, and they'll all go to school. But only one she'll choose. The next Elvira! Hell yeah! The search for the next Elvira, Saturday at midnight. Only on Fox Reality Channel. Saturday. Celebrate the new Fox Reality Channel original series, The Search for the Next Elvira. I'm hosting a marathon of Who Wants to Marry My Dad. So don't miss your chance to come check out my bag of goodies. It's the Who Wants to Marry My Dad marathon, Saturday, 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 Pacific, on Fox Reality Channel. Welcome back to Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Please welcome to the stage, from So You Think You Can Dance, Mary Murphy and Benji Schwimmer. 
Well, really, it's an honor to be presenting this award with Mary Murphy, and it kills me that you don't know how articulate this woman is. Honestly, okay? For instance, backstage, Mary was explaining the inner workings of the World Health Organization. It's true. Uh, what's that called for short, Mary? There you go. Good, 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 good. Right. The who. See, not that many reporters all write right, that very all right. Forget that thing, Mandy. I'm telling you. We're here to talk about the real bad boys about reality television. That's right. That's right. And everybody likes a bad boy. I know I do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We had some original bad boys here earlier. I know Hugh Hefner was over there. Uh-huh. Right the there, me right down there. There's a bad boy. Uh-huh. Yeah, we got some I bad boys. You. That's a bad man oh, right there. Oh, there's another one right over there. Yeah, right I know on. who all the bad boys in the room are. Yeah? Um, Do you think I'm a bad boy, Mary? I don't know, Benji. Do I deserve a spanking, Are you maybe? a bad boy? What? <laughs> Get out of town, uh, please. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, you guys, the nominees for Favorite Villain are... Favorite Villain, Dustin Diamond. He's even less talented than I thought. And this is Cletus talking with DeBrat. Oh, Brad, you know... What do you think uh, Dustin's doing right now? I don't know, man. I don't know, Cletus. When I say Cecile is bright, I mean her hair. You can take the blonde to the ranch, but you can't take the bikini off the blonde. And that was our major focus going in here tonight. Johnny V couldn't stand the thought of losing Scott Baio's cast-offs. I don't have an agenda. You do no, have I an don't. agenda. No, I'm just having a good time. Johnny! For God's sake, don't stifle my times with Scott Baio. I'll say this for Evil Dick. He knew how to keep an oath. I promise, on the life of your daughter, I am going to make you so miserable every day. Renee was as diabolical as her cackle. Do you believe she says something like that? Oh, man. Oh, my God. Larissa proved a charm school education is a terrible thing to waste. You sitting up there, first off, first off, you Favorite villain. All right. And the real teeny for favorite villain goes to. Give me that thing. Uh -oh. Evil Dick. <laughs> supporting cast giving me so much good material there's no way it could have ever happened um, thank you guys very much and thanks to everyone that was on the show and all the love support and the hate I've gotten on the street <laughs> thanks You know, Mark, four years ago, when I was hanging out with you, wasted, falling down drunk in a gutter, if you'd have told me I would have won this award, I'd have said you were crazy. But uh, I guess we did it, Mark. We did it! Let's go, yes. America! Fuck reality! <laughs> reality TV may be known for its showmances, but few have turned into something lasting until much more than after the next commercial. Unlike the happily betrothed stars of the upcoming Chris and Adrian from Russia with Love, the traveling Vickersons of reality TV. Please welcome Christopher Knight and Adrian Curry. You know, when the producers asked Chris and I to hand out the award for favorite hottie, we were really flattered. You know, we we're really pleased. I, I couldn't help but think all that. What pushed us over the top? I mean, I know I used to work out, and, and, you know, but it can't be the abs or the guns, because I'm married now, and those are Chris. going right down the frickin' tubes. Uh, so then I thought maybe it was, uh, it was my, uh, my classic smile. That must have been what it was, huh? Uh, uh, no, wait a second. And then I thought, wait a second, it's the total package thing. And including Chris. Adrian. What? Honey, we're not up for the favorite potty. Quit looking at yourself. I knew that. 
The nominees for favorite hottie are... Favorite hottie. Bridget's no flash in the pan, but she knows something about flashing. The New Year's Eve party at the mansion is just a little bit more glamorous, fancy. Oh, we had a lot of fun. Jen gets a little touchy. I did not want Dick touching me. I don't want some old man, like, you know, wiping my body off. Brooke makes others feel as good as she looks. Are you Brooke Hogan? Yeah, I am. Making a house fight? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm Thank you, sir. Oh, no, I'm JP's looking good and doing good. I'm hoping that there's more good than bad that comes through this, but either way, all I know is that at least I'm going to be happier with myself. Ollie girls, I don't know much about art, but these girls make quite a canvas. We wore a sexy airbrush t-shirt. Yeah, it's like when they paint right there. It's kinda cold. Bob Harper, who he doesn't make swoon, he makes sweat. They're gonna be able to run a lot faster without a teammate on their back. Go, 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 go! Favorite hottie. And the reality he goes to. I would give it to Shay, aka Bucky's ass, but I can't. Bridget from Girls Next Door. Thank you very much. This is a big honor. And when Hef first told me I was nominated, I didn't even believe him. I had to see it in writing. And I, so thank you, Hef, Holly, Kendra, Sarah, Crystal, Janine, for coming out and supporting me. And thank you to all the fans for making us the number one show on E! Thank you, guys. We'll be back with more from Hollywood Hotspot Boulevard 3 and the 2007 Really Awards. Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Find out who wins the realitini for favorite potty mouth and baddest bitch. Plus, American Idol Sanjaya performs live. <laughs> I could go to jail for that, people. No, Thank I'm you. Now. Oh, okay, then it's fine. <laughs> and later, if you think you've seen it all, wait till you see the incident that set the reality world on its head. What's going on? Why is the ambulance here? I think it's the guy saw Bloody from when he got thrown out the sticky. Yeah. When Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards returns. All right. I got Eve, Socket, Devil, Rabbit. I'll be right out. Let's do this. I got dibs on Socket. I'm almost there. All right, you ready? Let's go. Wow. How you doing? I'm Adam. Hi, Adam. I'm Eve. This is too weird. <laughs> what are the odds? Totally random. They've got a little captain in them. Got a little captain in you. Drink responsibly. When it comes to going bald, you now have a choice. Advances in medical science have resulted in the world's first and only permanent solution to hair loss. It is your real hair. It's your natural hair. You wash it, you cut it, you swim with it. Bosley is the world's most experienced hair restoration experts, having pioneered virtually every major advancement in the art and science of hair restoration. I'm very, uh, very satisfied, very happy with what I've done. This has got to be one of the best decisions I've made in my life, I'll tell you that. Bosley Hair Restoration is a relatively simple outpatient procedure. The results look completely natural, and it's affordable on nearly any budget. Call the toll-free number now to receive your free no-obligation information kit that will help you decide if hair restoration at Bosley is right for you. You don't have to accept going bald. Do something about it right now. Call 1-800-363-9153. That's 1-800-363-9153. Call now. Homeowners, want to refinance and get cash? Countrywide has a great reason to do it now. A no-cost refi. It has no points, no credit reporting fee, no processing fee, no document fee, and no third-party fees. No title or escrow fees. Absolutely no closing costs. So you wind up with a lot more cash. Call now and ask for a no-cost refi. We're America's number one home loan lender, and no one can do what Countrywide can. Call 1-800-641-7086.
There's what's real. Then there's Fox Reality Channel. Hi. The only network 100% dedicated to reality TV and more. And we bring it your way all day and all night. What a piece of this. Reality Revealed goes behind the scenes to bring you exclusive. That kiss is real. With all the extras you crave. I was getting turned on. And Fox Reality Channel Originals are fresh, bold, and controversial. All you need is Fox Reality Channel. Because you just can't get enough. He drives a diesel out of Dallas All in cars out to the coast It ain't the dream that he remembered in Just a few short years ago But tonight at a truck stop I'll drink and make up The waitress grins and winks at him And says my shift's almost up with so much riding on the choice at hand The spirit of a boy Or the wisdom of a man With so much riding on the choice at hand The spirit of a boy Right choices. Or Pass the them on. Of a, man. a message from the Foundation for a Better Life. Welcome back to Boulevard 3, Hollywood's hottest club. Welcome back to Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. It's reality TV's Christmas, 4th of July, and Arbor Day all rolled into one. And it tastes like chicken. Our next presenters are the pimp and the porn star. One gets paid by the hour, the other by the inch. Please welcome from this Real Life Fame Games, Ron Jeremy and the owner of HBO's Cat House, Dennis Hawk. Hey! Hello, everybody. I'm Ron Jeremy, living proof that anybody can get laid. Daddy D, Yay. how's the Cat House show doing? We're number one now that the Sopranos are gone. Yay! Is it true that you put the hoe in HBO? Ron, there ain't no business like hoe business. What corny dialogue. Listen, <laughs> they're doing a reality show about you. You heard of Pimp My Ride, right? Yeah. It's called Pimp My Pimp. Ron, there's only one Pimp Master General, and it's me. Listen, the nominations, and this is a really exciting award. It's called America's Favorite Potty Mouth. Nominations are... Favorite Potty Mouth. Chef Ramsay got up on the wrong side of the bed. Can you get out the way? I'm trying to serve food. Can you I'm get out sorry. the way? Stand out the way. Dustin Diamond's arrogance bottomed out. I hate the show, dude. I can't stand all these people. I couldn't give up, man. I'm in the with a colonic. Evil Dick demonstrated how he got his name. You lying sack of You can say it to anybody else, I know the truth, you Liar. I'm full to hear with your Adrian Curry, good clean family fun, Brady style. This is awesome. Let's get trash. Don't with the family. Favorite potty mouth. And I could feel the anticipation. And the reality goes to. Oh, here we go. It goes to Adrian Curry, my fair Brady. She won best potty now. She's fine. to cuss at. Thank you. I want to thank my mom and my father for teaching me everything I know. And I want to tell all you to off. I'm shaking right now. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I didn't drink enough to prepare myself for this. <laughs> so 
give me a little bit of insight as what's going on down there. It seems really crazy. Oh my gosh, this is a wild and crazy party. Like Hepco's, this is like no other uh, award show I've ever seen. I'm like, I know. Everyone's partying. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce our next performer. One glimpse of his luxurious mane on American Idol could make 20 million women swoon simultaneously. Though he wasn't the American Idol, he was the idol of most Americans. And he's here tonight to sing the lovely song, These Words. Please welcome Sanjaya. Threw some chords together, the compassion, D-E-F, to who I am is what I do, and I was gonna lay it down for you, trying to focus my attention, but I feel so A-D-D, I need some help, some inspiration, cause it's not coming easily, trying to find the magic, trying to write a classic, don't you know, don't you know, don't you know. Waste been full of paper, clever rhymes, see you later. So these words are my own, from my heart flow. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. There's no other way to better say. I love you, I love you. Read some Byron, Kelly and Sheets, excited over a hip hop beat. With dead poets and drum machines I know I had some studio time booked But I couldn't find a killer hook Nothing I write is ever good enough These words are my own From my heart flow I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you Curtain pull away, no hyperbole to hide behind. Whoa. 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 Trying to find the magic, trying to write a classic. It's been full of paper, clever rhymes. See you later. Bitches I know, from Big Brother 8, it's Jen, and from Last Comic Standing, it's my little kukla aunt. All right, 
the baddest bitch, the femme fatale from film noir to reality TV. She is the lady you want to freaking hate, but you need to love. Nice rack. <laughs> but why does she have to be called the baddest bitch? I mean, how would you like to be called the baddest bitch of reality? Actually, I'm sort of pissed off I wasn't nominated. I'm actually surprised that Janice Dickinson wasn't nominated. <laughs> I'm surprised she's on that much Percadan. Well, these are the nominees for the baddest bitch. Baddest bitch. Renee preferred a cat fight to a catwalk. No matter how much I want it to happen, I don't think that it's going to. Renee, shut the heck up. Get out of my face. Jillian was a fanatic soldier in the Battle of the Bulge. Beatings, 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 beatings. I expect nothing less than your best. Pick it up. And some more beatings. Arissa was just as rude the second time around. Things have to change if I'm going to be around these people. Things have to change and change now. Pumpkin got prissy with authority. I don't know many principals that talk to their students. Maybe she needs a different job. Cecile couldn't hold her liquor or her temper. Not only am I hot and sexy, but I'm smart and I'll kick your ass. Baddest bitch. And then the winner for baddest bitch is from Charm School Pumpkin! for more of Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, who will win the Realitini for Favorite Loser? Oh, I've won. You already know. Well, no, I, I don't know if I won the award, but, you know, as far as being, you know, involved in something very real, Adrian's back there. It's very real. <laughs> <laughs> and from Big Brother 8, America's player has some unfinished business. Yikes, I see the word dick. Can't be good. It's going to be great. Plus, the reality fall to end it all. You've seen the clip, but you haven't seen the full story yet, both on stage and backstage. All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. I believe in music the way some people believe in fairy tales. What I hear came from my mother and father. Once upon a time, they fell in love. What are you looking at? You. Tonight, the sky... I have to go. Let me walk you home. No, it's complicated. Hey. Reminds me of your love. Listen to me. Dad. You have to give the baby up. My love. Somewhere inside me, I know that they always wanted me. How long have you been here? 11 years and 16 days. I've been counting. The music. I thought if I could play it, they would know I was alive and find me. We're never going to see your parents again. If they don't find us, we'll just have to go find them. What's the point in singing? She's not going to hear me. Can I help you? I'm trying to find my son. Name? I don't know. You gotta love music more than you love food, more than life, more than yourself. Remember Mozart? It was like a musical pie. Prodigy. Exactly. Well, I have one of those, and he's living under my bed. Why is it so important that you want him now? I've always wanted him. The number one heat wave, August Red! It's like someone's calling out to me. Only some of us can hear it. Only some of us are listening. I know it sounds crazy.
crazy. I could hear him. I swear I could hear him. Let me out. Let me out. This is him. You know what music is? Harmonic connection between all living beings. It's all around us. All you have to do is listen. August Rush. Rated PG. Starts November 21st at a theater near you. The Fox Reality Channel Really Awards 2007 is brought to you in part by Warner Brothers' new motion picture, August Rush, in theaters Wednesday, November 21st. Fox Reality Channel, all reality, all the time. More originals, imports, exclusives, interaction, and more ways to watch. We are obsessed, obsessed with reality. You understand that? With Reality Revealed, Fox Reality brings you all your favorites with extra juicy twists you won't get anywhere else. I wanted the headlights up. I didn't want them looking down. And Fox Reality Originals are bold and controversial. Damn. Our outrageous series push the limit. They give you a lot more. And Kennedy gets you the latest on the world of reality every day with Reality Remix. She sure looks like she tastes good. <laughs> and only we've got the U.S. premieres that'll show you how they do it around the globe. <laughs> Want even more? Fox Reality gives it to you wherever you want it, whenever you want it. Here we go. Fox Reality Channel, obsessed. Got a problem with that? Welcome back to Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Please welcome to the stage, from Big Brother All-Stars, Marcellus, and from Rock of Love, Heather Chadwell. I need one of these at my house. This is fun. Who can install this in my house? I love it. Anyways, unfortunately, you, can, you can't have a winner without losers. Go figure. Hi, Howie. And you can't have a loser without backstabbing and lots of betrayal. Go figure. Many of reality's most enduring characters may not have won the show, but ultimately won the viewer's hearts. That'd be me. I won the viewer's hearts, damn it. <laughs> Just well, not I'm Brett America's, Michaels, damn it. I'm America's black gay sweetheart, but unfortunately all the other house guests hate me. <laughs> I hurt you, bitch. That's all that matters. I hurt you too. <laughs> the nominees for the favorite loser are... Favorite loser, Bonnie couldn't stand the heat. Fettuccine with the Thai sweet prawns. Yep, and the prawns are slightly overcooked. I know. Melissa keeps overcooking my prawns. Ian's a good loser. And leaving right now, Ian and Cheryl. <laughs> David and Mary, some down home charm exported around the world. We got a tow rope. Okay, we can tow you out. Get in. Yes, she's ready. There we go. She's coming. She's coming. Sanjaya was as sly as he is smooth. Sanjaya to me is love. Sanjaya. Well, I promise you, we won't soon forget you. <laughs> Ron Jeremy. Ron laid down the law. You don't say full release or happy ending. Oh, my Ron, God. you're nasty. <laughs> Rob, you know all those times you've grabbed me? I'll give you a facial. Yao Man had a brilliant strategy. My first priority is not let anybody know that I got immunity idol. So I start out making my own immunity idol. Favorite loser. And the reality he goes to... The favorite loser is... Sanjaya from American Idol! You're a loser! Woo! Woo! This is the best thing I've ever gotten from losing something, so I'm happy, so it's all good. I want to thank everyone who made this happen, all the fans. I definitely want to thank all the fans because I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them. So thank you. Adrian, this is, it's a great award. It's a reality. It's a big deal in the reality world. 
Did you ever think you could win an award like this for having such a quick, quick, snappy tongue? Well, after winning my first award before this for smoking weed, I figured anything was up for grabs and uh... We're definitely trending. I'm not sure in what direction. Well, as many of you know, the big twist in the Big Brother house this summer was America's player. He happens to be sitting right here, Eric Stein. Now, Eric, America asked me to give you this. You have one more set of instructions. Uh, let's hope they don't screw me again. Here we go. Yikes, I see the word dick. It can't be good. <laughs> it's going to be great. Oh, well, hey, I've been there, done that. America has voted for Eric to smother evil dick with kisses. Well, hey, listen, America, I, I would have liked it to be Jessica or maybe Zach, but uh, I see what you're doing here. I understand where you're coming from, so I'm going to do the best I can for you. And lo and behold, here he is, so. Oh! Whoa, Nelly. America. Thank it, you, sir. <laughs> hey, is that an evil dick in your pocket, or are you just happy to see Eric? <laughs> uh, it's a midget. Oh, well, hey. his plan. <laughs> Same thing. Coming up next, on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, we award the Realitini for America's favorite reality show. So I'm a loser for a loser award. That's a double negative. Now, a double negative You're almost is a, a winner. Positive. Yeah, two negatives is a positive. So if, you, if you're a loser for a loser, you're actually a winner. And the reality moment that has been the talk of the nation when Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards continues. All right. I got Eve, Socket, Devil, Rabbit. I'll be right out. Let's do this. I got dibs on Socket. I'm almost there. All right, you ready? Let's go. Wow. How you doing? I'm Adam. Hi, Adam. I'm Eve. This is too weird. <laughs> Totally random. They've got a little captain in them. Got a little captain in you. Drink responsibly. Till now, one single letter has always been on America's favorite chocolate candies. So if you wanted to spell out your feelings with them, the one thing you could say was, hmm. But now, go to this website and you can create M&Ms that express so much more. So not only can you say, I love Trevor, you can say, Trevor forever. Even wish someone a happy 40th birthday. But why stop? While you're online, you can let your folks know you remembered their anniversary. Announce a new arrival in the family. Even just say, thanks for being you. But remember, while there are millions of things you can say on America's favorite chocolate candies, the response is always the same. And hey, order today, and you'll even get a free bonus bag only online at mymms.com slash offer2. So get your free bag today at mymms.com slash offer2. My M&Ms, what would yours say? You want to know how I lost over 30 pounds on Jenny Craig? My way. By going into a center, meeting with my consultant, and tailoring a plan to meet my lifestyle. But you may not be like me. You may want to do Jenny's at-home program with consultations over the phone and meals delivered to your door. If that's your way, Jenny Direct is right for you. Lose 20 pounds for $20 plus the cost of food and shipping. Call 1-800-96-JENNY today. See, we're not so different. Sure, I may say in center and you may say at home, but who cares as long as the weight comes off. Have you called Jenny yet? Only minutes remain until the chefs finish making macaroni surprise with secret ingredients. Well, if you ask me, reality is the best thing ever. I love it. Who says you can watch too much reality? They're crazy. Miss Baker is using last Thursday's special, the chicken taco pizza, to add zest to her macaroni. Very interesting. I know who loses the most weight, gets the rose, you know, the important stuff. I'm a fully informed American citizen. Oh, that's... Wonderful! If reality TV has taken over your life, we understand. We love it too. Terrific! If I want to watch, I'm gonna watch. Got a problem with that? Fox Reality. Obsessed. He drives a diesel out of Dallas. 
All in cars out to the coast It ain't the dream that he remembered in Just a few short years ago But tonight at a truck stop I'll drink and make up The waitress grins and winks at him And says my shift's almost up With so much riding on the choice at hand The spirit of a boy Or the wisdom of a man With so much riding on the choice at hand The spirit of a boy Right choices Pass them on. A message from the Foundation for a Better Life. Welcome back to Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Our next award is my personal favorite. I have removed myself from the running to make way for some hungrier kids out there. Presenting favorite host and judge, please welcome from Beauty and the Geek, Richard Rubin, and from Hogan Knows Best, oh my goodness, Brooke Hogan. You're feeling a little bit loose tonight, aren't you? Loosey goosey, I just had half a beer. <laughs> I feel very qualified to hand out this award. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> as I've been judging this crowd all night, and I might say, there's some pretty wild party people in here. Don't encourage them. They're going insane. They want to know who the best host slash judge is, and they don't want to wait another second. For people who don't know the difference between a judge and a host, a judge has opinions. And a host has better hair. Now, can we please do this before they turn on us? I've got a fear of mobs, and imagining them naked is only complicating the situation. Well, as my dad would say, all right, brother, the nominees are. Favorite judge or host? Mary Murphy displayed more energy than the dancers. You have two tickets, the two of you, on the hot tamale train. <laughs> and he made a mountain out of an anthill. It's not going to ruin the show. Right well, if I bail. It, then bail, Dustin. You're what? out. Well, bail. All right. Len Goodman. Few judges enjoyed themselves as much as Len. You gyrated, you rotated, and you pulsated. It was like watching a stripper. It was such great fun. Phil Kogan's likability made bad news easier to swallow. I'm hugging you. <laughs> Ryan Seacrest remained unflappable against Simon's barbs. Simon, any advice on the high heels? You should know, Ryan. Oh. Stay out of my closet. Donald Trump's fashion sense was as sound as his business savvy. I'm a pretty wild guy. I mean, I have certain tastes that I think is a little bit out there. Right. I would never wear a suit with a lot of pink in it. Carrie Ann and Naba. With Carrie Ann, it was tough love. You're the worst dancer in the competition, <laughs> and there just wasn't anything to that routine. And then you are not supposed to lift. You're not allowed to. You broke a rule, too. Favorite judge or host? And the reality goes to... Thank you, Brooke. Mary Murphy.
You can tell America. Are you really as evil as they say you are? I'm just as much of an ass in real life as I am on the show. Well, to present the reality TV for America's favorite reality show, we have from Big Brother, America's player, Eric Stein, and from Surreal Life Fame Games, it's Denmark's player, Brigitte Nielsen. Hey, everybody. How are you? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. <laughs> Woo! Say hey. something, Eric. All right, what can I do? Reality TV is great. I mean, after all, I got involved in an incredible showmance. <laughs> Well, you don't have to tell me how great reality is. I mean, um, let me see. I was in a showman's myself. It's very true. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Actually, um, would you be up for an award man's? Whoa. Yeah. Oh, all right, all right. <laughs> well, yeah. see me later, all right? All right, baby. The nominees for America's favorite reality show are... America's favorite reality show. Intense emotions surfaced on Survivor. I know this is a passion for him. A lot of people look at it as a game, but I just want to be okay. Dancing with the Stars had all the excitement and all the moves. It was riddled with uh, bad footwork oh, when you were in oh, hole. Oh, oh, I'm telling you, don't say oh, I'm no. Are you know, your knickers in a twist or something? <laughs> American Idol showed its tender side. Lakeisha, I actually could kiss you after that. <laughs> America's Got Talent had boyish charm. You are the reason I just love this show. <laughs> I think you are absolutely amazing. Big Brother 8 had plenty of fireworks. Oh, Princess, how is your morning? How is it waking up to pots and pans in your ear? Extreme Makeover Home Edition brought joy wherever it went. <laughs> America's favorite reality show. All right, now, and the winner is... The Let's winner is... It. America's favorite reality show is... American, American Idol! Idol. Congratulations, we've won the Realitini Award. Very nice, right? This is very exciting. I recommended that we go and accept in person, but we couldn't be there because Simon didn't want to travel. Okay, well, it's uh, obviously taken from Randy's breakfast table. Yes. Oh, yeah, okay. right, well, yes. right. I'd like to thank you very much indeed for ever voted. Um, That's everybody watching. This is a team effort, this show. Yes, um, yes, he's yes, me away. yes, oh, yes. Oh. I would really like to dedicate this award to mm -hmm. actually the three people on my right. Thank oh, you. Oh, Even though nice. it's a small role, it's an important oh, role. No. Oh, it's oh, some oh, of all parts. Some, yes, some of, of all, all parts. parts. Anyway, yes. but most importantly, thank you for voting for me. Um, for you. Oh. I, thank you, people. I thank love you. winning awards. You absolutely um, love us. Oh, my God, they and, love us. Oh, it says to Simon Cowell, thank you very no, much. No, it does um, not. But... This really does mean a lot. Thank you so much. Thank you guys very much. Thank you so much. And now, can I just say, whoever made what is possibly the worst looking trophy, <laughs> which is also made of plastic, we'd like one made in metal, please. Yes. Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, we award the Realitini for favorite moment of prayer and favorite competition show. This is not about playing along. This is about playing along. Are you seriously coming on to me right now? Yeah. See, like I said before, I take care of you. you're not going to get this on Entertainment Tonight. You're not going to get this on Access Hollywood, only on Fox Reality. With search for the next Elvira's Elvira and breaking Bonaducci's Danny Bonaducci. Danny, I got to ask you, have you ever dined in hell? Are you kidding? I'm getting a divorce. I dined in hell for the last 17 years. Oh, hell, Danny. <laughs> yeah. Plus, the most eye-opening crash in the history of reality television. <laughs> All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Here's some good news for smokers. You can quit smoking. That's right. 
If you've tried everything to quit, patches, gum, lasers, even injections, well, finally, there's an FDA-listed medical device to help you stop smoking that really works. This is Zero Smoke, a breakthrough in medical technology that can help you kick the cigarette habit in as little as seven days. Zero Smoke's two 24-karat gold-plated therapy biomagnets use auricular therapy to help free you from your desire to smoke. Wear them on your left ear for two to four hours a day. That's it. Now continue to smoke, but in less than a week, you'll start to lose your desire to smoke. Zero Smoke uses acupressure to create a precise pressure point that helps curb your desire to smoke by causing the release of the same feel-good endorphins that smoking does. Over two million people have used Zero Smoke to help them kick the habit. I started smoking about 30 years ago, and it just feels so good to now be a non-smoker, finally. I tried gum, patch, cold turkey, everything. Nothing worked until Zero Smoke. Now that I've quit smoking with Zero Smoke, I feel like I can accomplish anything. Patches and gums can cost hundreds a month and still leave you addicted to the nicotine. We're so sure Zero Smoke will work for you, we'll send it to you absolutely free. Just pay shipping and processing. Try it free for two weeks with our zero risk guarantee. If you don't lose the desire to smoke, send it back. It costs you nothing. If you've tried everything and thought you could never quit, zero smoke is the answer. It really works and it's easy. When you call, ask how to get a second zero smoke for a friend or loved one. Here's how to order. To get your zero smoke, call 1-800-279-1448. It really works. That's 1-800-279-1448 to stop smoking now. 1-800-279-1448. Call now. Homeowners, want to refinance and get cash? Countrywide has a great reason to do it now. A no-cost refi. It has no points, no credit reporting fee, no processing fee, no document fee, and no third-party fees. No title or escrow fees. Absolutely no closing costs. So you wind up with a lot more cash. Call now and ask for a no-cost refi. We're America's number one home loan lender, and no one can do what Countrywide can. Call 1-800-641-7086. Will you accept this rose? Sure. Will you accept this rose? Oh. This is awkward. I'm just not into you. You could say I'm into reality. At least I know who's still racing, cooking, dancing, dating. You name it. If I want to watch, I'm going to watch. OK? If reality TV has taken over your life, we understand. We love it, too. She's got some issues. She buys a lot of roses. Fox Reality. Obsessed. Welcome back to Boulevard 3, Hollywood's hottest nightclub. No, for real, though, is there anyone here you think that, that uh, you like to see? Bobby, so Bobby Trendy's cute. Yeah, he's so weird, though, Bobby Trendy. He's weird. That's such a weird ass. But see, I like the weird people and then the normal, and that's the balance, and you're the normal. Do you like when I touch your face? I'm getting sexually molested like by the girl guy from YouTube. Please welcome from celebrity rap superstar Perez Hilton and from Big Brother 8, Danielle Donato. When I was on Big Brother, sometimes I felt like I was on the 700 Club. Someone was always either crying or praying. Uh, I understand that. I am currently praying for Britney Spears. I am praying that Britney Spears will get her life together and stop being such a mess. Can I get an amen? Amen. The nominees for favorite moment of prayer are... Favorite moment of prayer. Jen in a bunny suit was the answer to viewers' prayers, not Jamika's. <laughs> now I'll hide the egg. God was Safari's corner man. Lord, please forgive me for beating this bitch ass today, Lord. Is that really Lord. necessary? Well, you better quit interrupting my prayers before God direct me to whoop your ass. Dog gave God an honorable mention. And Lord, you know, you can show her that we're all gangsters, too. 
but we're gangsters with a little bit of God in us. Amber thought God had nothing better to do with his time than listen to her. God, it is strong. <laughs> I mean, I know Dick says I'm a bad mom and stuff for doing drugs, but I w I'm not a bad mom. I'm a good mom. And not even God can understand what Sister Patterson was saying. <laughs> favorite moment of prayer. If I got to pick the winner of the favorite moment of prayer, I would give it to Kathy Griffin for her Emmy acceptance speech, where she told Jesus to suck it. Unfortunately, I can't, so I have to give it to this loser. The favorite moment of prayer goes to Jamika from Big Brother 8. Funny. I was nominated for America's Favorite Loser and I lost. So I'm a loser for a loser award. Right. That's a double negative. Now, a double negative you're is almost a, a winner. Yeah. yeah, two negatives is a positive. So if, you, if you're a loser for a loser, you're actually a winner. All right, to present the award for Favorite Competition Show, we have two stars who have been entertaining us for as long as we can remember from the upcoming search for the next Elvira. It's the Mistress of the Dark, whose show starts in a couple of minutes. And from Breaking Bonaducci, Danny Bonaducci. Can you hear me? It doesn't sound like it's on. Oh, oh ladies and Danny. gentlemen, yeah, Elvira, right. Mistress of the Dark. Thank you. Oh, Danny, I haven't had this much fun since I performed at that trailer park last year. God damn. Yeah, I know what you mean. Some of you need to go home and change the tires on your house. But right now, we are, we are loving giving away this award. I love competition games, whether it's a great fight, a horse race. I love a contest of skill. You know, that's funny, because my favorite reality show is nominated for this award, Hell's Kitchen! Yeah! Nice, nice. Yeah, you know, I have, I have dined there very often, and um, Danny, I gotta ask you, have you ever dined in hell? Are you kidding? I'm getting a divorce. I dined in hell for the last 17 years. Oh, hell, <laughs> Danny. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The nominees okay. for favorite competition show are... Favorite competition program, Hell's Kitchen Boiled Over. Oh, no, Bonnie, yeah, not shut. that, you f***ing here, you stupid cat. Do you know what? Every time I ask you a sensible question, you give me a dumb blonde answer. Sorry, Chef. Big Brother 8 exposed the naked truth. I really didn't want to do it, but of course I'm not going to let my team down, and when lots of clothing is at stake, <laughs> what is a girl to do? It was an arousing competition on I Love New York. I've never had two brothers fight for me before. I find it erotic. It's kind of sexy. It's weird. What's your name, huh? My girl Who that calling you? Months, man. That's him. The biggest losers, big winners couldn't get enough. Precise performance is highlighted so you think you can dance. Survivor raised the bar for reality TV. Favorite competition program. Are you ready? Elvira? And the winner is. The favorite competition program, so you think. Just 
they fall. Our dancers, woo! <laughs> oh, what a surprise! What guys. a surprise! Yeah. Well, we definitely have to thank Mike Darnell, Nigel Lipko, of course, who's really the the power behind this show and the force behind this show, and mm -hmm. Jeff Thacker, and Jeff man, Thacker, all yeah. the amazing, amazing dancers on the show and, and choreographers i well you know yeah well you know all the amazing choreographers that have gone on the show the amazing judges miss thank mary you, murphy thank you, thank and you. her beautiful scream as well the queen of scream is here to accept this beautiful anyways award. whoever voted for this i don't know who you are but thank you so much world peace, world peace. stay with us for more of fox reality channel's 2007 really awards Coming up on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards, discover who wins the Golden Realitini for Performer of the Year. I'm dealing with a stoner who cusses all the time. I mean, I got problems. I'm dealing with a drunk who gets angry all the time. Right, right, right. Then, Johnny Fairplay and Danny Bonaducci in an appearance you'll never forget. They're booing because they hate you. And a surprise visit by the surreal life's Alexis Arquette. Can we get Johnny up here? Is he all right? How about Kennedy? Where's a, where's a grassy knoll when you need one? Oh, Kennedy. Plus, a reality moment so spontaneous, so surprising, so unscripted, it'll change the way you look at reality and television forever. All that and more on Fox Reality Channel's 2007 Really Awards. Till now, one single letter has always been on America's favorite chocolate candies. So if you wanted to spell out your feelings with them, the one thing you could say was, hmm. But now, go to this website and you can create M&Ms that express so much more. So not only can you say, I love Trevor, you can say, Trevor forever. Even wish someone a happy 40th birthday. But why stop? While you're online, you can let your folks know you remembered their anniversary. Announce a new arrival in the family. Even just say, thanks for being you. But remember, while there are millions of things you can say on America's favorite chocolate candies, the response is always the same. And hey, order today and you'll even get a free bonus bag only online at mymms.com slash offer2. So get your free bag today at mymms.com slash offer2. My M&Ms, what would yours say? Unitrin Direct Auto Insurance, you get excellent prices, great coverage, and personal service. When you quote online, you'll save $50. That's UDAuto.com or toll-free 1-888-UDAuto-8. few short years ago but tonight at a truck stop I'll drink in makeup the waitress grins and winks at him and says my shift's almost up with so much riding on the choice at hand the spirit of a boy all the wisdom of a man with so much riding on the choice of hand, the spirit of a boy. Right choices. All Pass the them on. Of a, man. a message from the Foundation for a Better Life. Welcome back to Boulevard 3, Hollywood's hottest club. Did you think that? 
at the first season of the show, did you think that you'd be walking down a red carpet at a reality TV awards and winning a big martini glass? No, I mean, at least you got an award you can do something with. You know what I'm talking about, sister? <laughs> exactly. All right, presenting the Golden Reality for Performer of the Year. It's last year's winner. Well, you loved to hate him on Survivor Pearl Islands and hated that you loved him on Kill Reality. Jeff Probst banned him. Please welcome Johnny Fairplay. They, they took my beer, so we'll see what happens. Give it up for Evil Dick. <laughs> of all the realitinis handed out tonight, this is the most important one. Why? because it is voted on by the public. It represents the most difficult... Whoa, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Who's booing? Are you guys really booing? They're booing because they hate you. <laughs> That's a good thing, right? Oh, oh. Diddy, Diddy. Don't f with my Johnny. Oh, Danny, Danny, Danny. I can't believe you f your Johnny. Sorry, I'm not an American Indian tranny, but maybe I'll do. Can we get Johnny up here? Is he all right? Yeah. Yeah. Kennedy, where's a, where's a grassy knoll when you need one? Oh, Kennedy. Um, I'm Alexis Arquette, and we don't appreciate violence in reality, do we? So we all have our prayers for Johnny Fairplay that he didn't lose a tooth due to Danny Bonaducci's alcoholic rage. All right, it represents the most difficult challenge met. The winner of this award is someone who has captured the imagination and the heart of America. They are the person we look forward all week to seeing, the person we talk about at work all day, 
This is an award given to a character an actor played. This award recognizes America's love of the person for themselves. And who better to bestow the golden real teeny than the golden boy of reality TV, the guy who won last year, me. Oh no, that's Johnny Fairplay. <laughs> Nominees for Reality Performer of the Year are Reality Performer of the Year. Chris and Adrian didn't sugarcoat how they felt. Who is it those that, that you I listen to? Those I really respect, and you always say that you never really listen Who to your dad. Who are they? Why are you yelling at me? I'm pissed. Sanjaya's mohawk was almost as offbeat as his singing. Well, I presume there was no mirror in your dressing room tonight. <laughs> uh, I think you are in your own universe, and if people like you, good luck. <laughs> well, thank you. New York liked a man who liked her. He's pulling out my chair, he's pouring my champagne, he's looking into my eyes, and can't take his eyes off my cleavage. It killed Len Goodman to tell the truth. Dull, dull, dull. <laughs> totally lackluster. There was no fire. There was no performance. It was your worst dance. Evil Dick went over the top when he smelled the prize. Yes, we did! We did it! 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 We did it. We did it. <laughs> this is one ant you'd want at your picnic. Don't cheat. And remember, the scales don't lie. Reality Performer of the Year. And the Reality Performer of the Year is... America's Choice with Reality TV is Reality Performer of the Year, Evil Dick! Get on up here, Evil Dick! Wow, double winner tonight. Me and my daughter are still friends and getting along well. We don't talk anymore. <laughs> um, I guess it does pay off to be an uh, <laughs> $500,000 worth and a golden martini for performer of the year. Thank you very much to everyone that voted. I really do appreciate it. Um, thanks again. And it does pay to be an I'm here with Evil Dick, who just won Reality Entertainer of the Year. This is the best award going tonight. It's almost like our best actor, actress of the, the award show. How are you feeling? I feel good. I just beat Peter Brady and well, Sanjaya. <laughs> Did you ever think in a million years, doing the show like Big Brother and being in the house for that long, spending the whole summer there and winning, that you could come out of that and actually come to an award show and win the biggest award of the night, my friend? Uh, absolutely not. I. Even with Big Brother, it was about, you know, getting me and Danielle to the end. And I figured that she would win. Um, coming out of there with half a million dollars and now two awards. Not two best awards. Best performer and best villain. I mean, come on. Rules. Rock the show. Had a great time here. And, uh, yeah, it was very cool. Do you know I th actually think uh, Johnny Fairplay lost a tooth while, while introducing them? I know that Johnny Fairplay uh, came up to me earlier and said... Um, if you win, I'm going to jump on you and act like I'm humping you, so catch me. And he did it to the wrong person.
goodness, I really feel like I've been through a religious experience. <laughs> Congratulations to all of tonight's winners, nominees. Now, in a way, aren't we all winners? We are part of a cultural phenomenon. Reality TV is changing the face of television and influencing our society. Americans are tuning in by the millions to root for their favorite hero, enjoy remarkable talent, even to seek inspiration from those who battle the stormy seas and those who battle their personal demons. The transformative power of reality TV is undeniable. Its future is in your hands. Remember, you can't escape reality, but you would want to even try. Good night. The Fox Reality Channel Really Awards 2007 is brought to you in part by Jose Cuervo Black. Please drink responsibly. What's keeping you from getting a good night's sleep? Hmm? Do you ever think it might be your bed? I'm Lindsay Wagner, and if you're not sleeping well or you wake up with back pain, please call us right now. It won't cost you a thing except a minute of your time, and we'll immediately send you this free DVD or video and brochure with all the details about the sleep number bed, including complete descriptions, prices, and options. And you'll have all the information you need to get a great night's sleep. I guess I didn't realize how much I used to wake up during the night. And now I feel like I just sleep through the night and sleep like a rock. For me, it's really helped with, uh, with my back and, and uh, giving me a more comfortable night's sleep. The Sleep Number Bed is the first bed designed with your personal comfort in mind. Unlike uncomfortable steel springs, the Sleep Number Bed contours to your body so your muscles begin to relax and you get a deeper, more luxurious night's sleep. Plus, the bed adjusts on both sides, which is perfect for couples. In fact, it's clinically proven to improve sleep quality and relieve back pain. And it costs about the same as a traditional inner spring mattress, but it lasts twice as long. You know, I never thought my bed was the reason I wasn't sleeping through the night. I just thought that's the way it was. But this bed is so comfortable. I fall asleep easier and I sleep right through the night. Select Comfort has been helping people like you and me sleep better for over 20 years. So I highly recommend you learn more about this bed that over 4 million Americans have switched to. Call us today. Call 1-800-820-1990 for your free information kit with video or DVD brochure and price list. Call this number now and you'll also receive a special $50 thank you gift card just for inquiring about the Sleep Number Bed. Ask about our risk-free 30-night in-home trial. Call 1-800-820-1990 for your free information kit and this free $50 thank you gift card only available through this special TV offer. That's 1-800-820-1990. Call now. 10,000 blinks, 20,000 breaths, 100,000 beats. It's just another day for the incredible human machine. Sunday on Nat Geo. Saturday, Fox Reality Channel has a question. 
Who's the bee or host that will make love to a ghost? Elvira, darling. Spooky. She's big 13 lucky ghouls, and they'll all go to school. But only one she'll choose. The next Elvira! Hell yeah! The search for the next Elvira, Saturday at midnight. Only on Fox Reality Channel. Today on Blind Date. Oh, oh my. He's got some smooth moves and some even smoother lines. I call myself a Snickers, you know why? Because I'm always satisfied. Do they work? You don't participate in the game? Nope. Are you saying you're a virgin? Plus... Do I want to have sex with you? Oh, yeah. No. For this guy, once sex is off the table, there's nothing...